relax. Guys, I introduce you to my beautiful wife. I'm introducing you to my husband, my has handsome husband, H H. H and H. H and H. Alright, welcome to another video. And uh, today we're giving you some good juice. Good juice? Hey, you kind of juice is that? You know that juice I'm talking about. You know that juice you are thinking though. <laughs> oh good juice pineapple juice or watermelon juice <laughs> orange juice ginger and usha no she feel hot can you imagine usha has just distracted me but it's fine it's fine okay so we are sharing something with you that she is better to tell the story oh uh um we are we are here to talk about this my child the process I went through, what I went through, and what happened, and all of that, you know. I want to say actually, but I'm stopping it. <laughs> so, yeah. We went to the hospital on a Saturday. That was on the... Um, Saturday evening. Saturday evening. We went in the morning. Yeah. That was, uh, I think, 15th of um, April. Yeah. We went on the 15th of April, and we went to the hospital, and the doctor said, oh, I was like, I've passed my, um, that was, about, that was about 41 weeks. Yes, that was my, 40, my 41 yeah, weeks. Yeah, so she did 41 exactly, 41 weeks. For exactly 41 weeks. But the baby came 41 in two days. Yeah. Because of the, um, yeah. yeah, so, when the doctor was like, okay, because of what is happening, um, we would, we should come back in the evening and start the process. That's, that's the day. So um, they'll be admitted. So that will be admitted for, um, forced labor. Right here. Yes. So um, we went to the hospital and the hospital waited, 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 waited. And we were told at dawn, they'll start the process of the medication, that's they'll put the medicine under my tongue and all of that. So yes, we went to the hospital in the evening. We got there, we got prepared. They gave me, the, I don't know, the line. They prepared me with the line and all, and I, I was ready. And then we started the process. At dawn, we started the process and I started laboring like but all of a sudden I was in pain but um I wasn't um what's the name contracting I wasn't contracting yeah. but I was in pain but I wasn't contracting because the, I was so the contraction started it, the pain started after the 24 hours is not no when they give you the medicine and it dissolves in four hours two okay, three for hours the first labor pain it will start yeah. so yeah um sorry so it started and started, started and we waited to the train to then it started the pain started then they'll come and check they said it's one centimeter yeah. we check we check it's still 1.5 centimeter right yeah. that's so right from when they started the they process, started the process. Yeah. in 24 hours they came to check and i'm still 1.5 yeah. but later in the evening and um, later in the day, that was when you came back. Yeah. You, you you went home and you came back, yeah. and they checked. And um, when he left, they checked and it was two centimeter. Yeah. So I didn't know about the two centimeters, but no. when I came home, that was the day that um, I got a book to write. Remember? Yes. Uh -huh. So when I came home, I think I, that day I came home with Ishra and Ishra prepared the, the uh, bread and egg, egg for, for you. Yeah. 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 So I slept, woke up, yeah. went back to the hospital, and I, but before that, I had a dream that. The civics has opened to two centimeters. Yeah. So when I went to the hospital, I was just there now. No, I called you. You called me now. I called you that um, it's two centimeters. No, it was when I got there before. Uh, when I got there, I mean, I got there, and then one lady was checking you. Yeah. And then she, I asked her how many centimeters, and she said two. two. And I said, Oh, I had a true. dream about it that it was two. Yeah, true. So, yeah. And uh, it was two till, till, till the next morning. So I was told I'll be giving the other dose um around 12 a.m right yes yeah, yeah. so around 12 a.m they give me the other dose and nothing still happened till the morning yeah. and that evening that sunday the pain i went through was so yes that evening i was in real pain i was in real pain i wasn't contracting so they were just checking 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 me why i was over shouting they told me i was just acting up but i was really in pain thinking i was contracting yes that evening i was really in pain and um they thought the nurses thought maybe I was really contracting that maybe I would be like seven, but they checked and nothing has happened. My water didn't break. Yeah, there wasn't any blood. 
but there was um, the mucus that the mucus that was coming here yeah. so i wasn't experiencing all of them but i've been given a full dose of the medication yeah. it wasn't happening so, so from the monday morning around 8 a.m the, the doctor came to see us and when he came to check up on us he asked me what was happening and i told him how i was feeling all of that and i told him that i felt a pain on my left side like it's a burning sensation with pain it's so painful that I, I i cried throughout the sunday morning to the monday morning yeah. and he was like okay then i should um I, I should do a urine test and then we did a urine test and then when we did the urine test it came out that i was um, having an infection around my kidney area so yeah. He suggested that we have to do an emergency CS. And before that, before the pain on the rim, I started feeling it like two weeks before the delivery time. Yes. You know, there's a saying that when there's a men and when their wives are pregnant, they got they get pregnant too. Yeah, well, they go through the same process. They go through the, the same process, and yeah. and it's uh, true. Honestly, I've gone through the same process with Franca from like day one. Yeah, from the day of the pregnancy. <laughs> from day one. Sometimes so, yeah. I eat and she asks me if I'm the one who is pregnant. <laughs> you remember? Yeah. And then, so the I was problem. feeling the pain uh, from my backside into my rib side. Yeah. So I actually went for a massage thinking that, oh, it, it will go. go. Wow. Yeah, but it didn't. It didn't go. So it was when, so I was, through that process, I was thinking that, so when her own started coming, I was like, ah, so could it be that because I was feeling it? No, I think after ah. I came back from there, CS. Yeah, then I discussed it with you. You said that, ah, the pain is gone. My like, pain is gone. Yeah. yeah. So, so it was after she was, than the giving birth cry that my pain also get yeah so um after he suggested we were there he was like he's leaving us to think about it before um we proceed so he left and victor wasn't okay with the sales but i i had a, a a free go ahead i had a go ahead to go because not it wasn't because um i, I was in pain so i wanted to go for the um cs mm -hmm. but I had a, some peace. I don't like CS. I, I had some peace in my heart to go for it. So when he came out, I was like, no, let's go for it. And he didn't want to accept. He was like, no, 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 no. He sat there. He was getting angry. And I told him that if so, call Mama J, our house of mommy, and talk to her. And um, he called her, spoke to her, and um, she didn't convince her, convince him. But she made, um, she spoke to her um, spiritually, physically, both sides, for him to understand where <laughs> he is going right. He didn't, he didn't really, did she really con convince him? She didn't convince him. But you know, it's like she used the word and all of that. And she gave me an example of, she gave me examples. Okay. And the examples is to mean that it's not really like a bad thing. The, yes. And you know, recently I was even thinking about it that hey, my brother Felix used to say uh, that, that that's the thing to me, whether CS or whether hey, people go through and they come out safe. Safe. Uh -huh. yes. He was recently I remembered what my brother said. So could it be that he was just telling me and encouraging me about it so that in case yeah. it happens then you just I already found myself one time. Yeah, so. But in the situation, it was a very tough decision. It was a very time. tough decision. So after that, um, he accepted it we had to fold the form and all of that they brought it oh immediately they brought the form of <laughs> our fold it and all of that we had to go and do blood test yeah my first one said this to see if everything was okay to check everything before i go to the theater and i had to call my mom to come because you know i, really, I needed the support of my mom and then you did call your mom no oh, just yeah. after yeah and then we're not prepared for CS. we're well. prepared for CS. so my mom it was raining that morning when i was going to the theater my mom had to come rashly and blah 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 she came and then you know mothers and what they want to do yeah. but when i was leaving i started crying i don't know and next came to take me to the when she came for me and she prepared me changed my came for me and i started crying i wasn't crying because i was afraid i was crying because it wasn't something i we expected it wasn't something i ever thought of going to do i didn't i never thought of it yes but i remember i had a dream that someone was operated on i don't remember if i told you or something i remember i told any dream i had when i was pregnant i was telling him but i remember i had a dream that a lady was operated and gave it to a baby girl you remember i told you i had a dream of a baby girl before a baby boy came so a lady was operated and um she, she gave it to a baby girl but I didn't really know the face, the person yeah. who did that. So 
when the, it, it, it all happened i was like oh goodness like like this was going so to happen so it was me and god didn't let me know like, okay maybe i didn't really understand the dream so i didn't take it as me yeah. you get that yes so yes and it happened i went to my cs i came out safe yeah. smooth and sound you can imagine trusting god that you are going for um, a normal bed and you go and come back home and you go to cs you can imagine it's actually, it's actually not it's actually not it's actually not an easy thing doing cs as many people might think it is easy it's not at all no. and um it's expensive as well yeah and so, so if you want to do cs you should really oh some people will just go for cs straight yeah. ahead so yes. that means that they have planned for it we yes. didn't plan we didn't for plan for so it. it took us by surprise, surprise. you can it imagine like took us by surprise you have to make that tough dangerous and scary decision yeah yeah, so we never planned for something and then we talk about it. its own yeah. cost. If you mention the cost, you'd be like, wow, but it's yeah. all good. We've dealt with it and we've come out Absolutely. safe. The baby is safe. The baby came out with no defects yeah. or effects or anything. She came out strong, safe, fine. I just went to my CS. I came out. I was fine. My BP never went up. I was okay. Yeah. Everything went well. So, yes. This is my child bed story. You can imagine. I've experienced normal bed and I've experienced CS. People saying CS is for the lazy women. Those people should be shut up. CS like, is not for lazy women. CS like, is crazy. Yeah. It's, it's very painful. Joke. There are a lot of complications yes. that you might have to <coughs> be very serious about. You can give it today and even pound for food tomorrow. Yeah. We can give it a normal bed, but CS would have to be in bed for the sort of hell for yeah. you to be Almost strong. Almost like two, three months. Almost six months because six months. you can't just do anything just like yeah. that. So you can imagine. Yeah. So yes. All right, guys. Thank you so thank much you for so much. watching. We appreciate it. Yeah. yeah. Shh. All right. It. So, okay, women are strong. Thank you. We love you. Like, subscribe, and comment. Much love. Bye.